Hey, thank you for being here. Thank you so much, and gracias, and, and merci, and uh, grazie, and all, that's all I know right now. I'm learning how to say thank you in other languages because my virtual audience is filled with people from different countries. Yay! So exciting. Last week, we were, uh, there were people from like countries that, that had never been a part of my audience before, uh, like Malta. And then uh, there were some countries that I didn't even know were countries, like Malta. <laughs> I ended up having the, the first ever Ellen's Audience Olympics. A woman named Lisa from Belgium won. She won the gold medal in the bottle flipping event. Um, <laughs> and here's what happened at the awards ceremony. For coming in first, can you sing the first two lines of your country's national anthem, please? Um, oh, no. <laughs> You're in Studio City, aren't you? You are not in Belgium. Oh, my god, my country is going to hate me for this. I don't know. She could not remember her own country's national anthem. And I don't want her to bring shame to Belgium. So I'm going to give her one more chance. Lisa? Hi. Hi. Hi, Lisa. Hi. <laughs> How are you today? I'm doing great. How what time you? is it there right now? It is 12 AM. 12 AM. All right, well, thank you for staying up, unless you always stay up. Um, so did anyone give you a hard time for not knowing the national anthem? Well, some people said, like, Lisa, I can totally relate. Like, who not knows our national anthem? But some people said, like, Lisa, it's a shame. This is a national anthem. And everybody began singing it to me for some reason. Oh. Well, so now you know it. I'm sure I, you were nervous. You're on television. I put you on the spot. So I'm giving you another chance. So go ahead and sing a little bit for us now. OK. Oh, she's going to play. Oh. Yeah. Oh, die that you know how to play it on piano, but you had forgotten the national anthem, even though you know how to play it on piano. That's, that's incredible. Thank you so much. Hey, say hi to everybody in Belgium and tell them uh, that uh, we love their waffles. OK. OK, bye, Lisa. Usually, the Olympics are every four years, but I decide what goes on around here. So we're going to do it again right now. It's time for our second edition of Ellen's Audience Olympics. <laughs> so once again, I've picked three people from three different countries to compete, and here they are. Representing North Macedonia is uh, Biljana. Is that right, Biljana? Yes, that's right. Hi. Hi. Hi, Biljana. What do you do, Biljana? A dentist. A dentist. Yes. Oh wow. All right. So you, you're you're uh, okay. Yes. Uh, what time is it there in Macedonia? <laughs> Uh, now it's uh, right past midnight. Right past midnight. OK. Well, thank you again for being here. Um, and from the country of Kenya is Martin. Where is Martin? Hi, Ellen. Hi. How are you? Hi, Martin. Hi. Hi. What, what do you do there? I just completed my aerospace engineering undergrad. Yeah. <laughs> OK. So you're a slacker. Uh, yeah, <laughs> just a slacker. Somebody just kind of hanging around, doing nothing. What time is it there in Kenya? A little past 2 AM. Oh, wow. Thank you for staying up. Thanks for being here. And finally, from up. Slovakia is Denisa. <laughs> Hi, Denisa. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Thank you for being here. What do you do in Slovakia? Oh, well, I do different stuff, uh, but I am mainly a master's student, and I work in HR. 
Okay, master student. Okay, I am master host. Okay. <laughs> so the three of you were going to be competing in bobsledding, but I'm told the bobsleds didn't get there in time, so that's a shame. Instead, you're going to be doing the whipped cream challenge, and if you don't know what it is, here's what it looks like. Yeah! Three. All right, so you, you hit it, and so it, it, it hits it, and it goes up like that, and it goes in your mouth. So you first of all, when I say ready, you'll put whipped cream on your hand, and then you will, the first person to get it in their mouth is going to take the gold, and we'll keep going for the second one for silver, and then you know how the Olympics goes. And there's the bronze. Okay, are you ready? Get your arms ready. Get your whipped cream out. All right, ready, set. Wait, wait, wait. Whipped cream on your arm, please, go. A nice amount, big amount, okay. On your marks, get set, go. <laughs> nope. Keep trying, keep trying. Oh, get easy. Keep going for silver, keep going for silver. Nope. Nope. I mean, yeah. Did you get it? No, he didn't. <laughs> there you go. You got it. Martin got silver. All right, we're good. All right. No need to keep going. You've gotten bronze. That's good. All right, that Denisa, that was fantastic. Have you done that before? I, I tried it today, but just once. <laughs> well, you're a master at that now, too. You do many things, you said. All right, each one, you can get that out of your eye, Martin. That's just terrible. It's still in your eye, the other eye. All right. Get the cover out. OK. You each represented your countries wonderfully, some wonderfully or more than others. But now we are going to put you up on Ellen's Audience Olympic podium for your medals. All right. <laughs> Denisa, you came in first, and now you can sing the first two lines of your country's national anthem. Awesome. Nata trousa bliska hromi divo biu. Nata trousa bliska hromi divo biu. Zastame i bratia vetja oni stacha. That's great. Thank you so much.